All right, y'all, we're installing Serato 3.2.2. This is a huge update. It comes with like the Rain Performer support, the Grav, Grav 6, whatever that is, support. Um, you're also getting the Apple Silicone M support. So if you guys have an M chip, this is full support for that. I'm actually gonna be going to update my MacBook right after this video as well. But for this, we're just gonna be installing Windows. It's gonna be the same process no matter what software you use. So let's hop into it right now. All right, so first off, all you're going to do, go to serato.com. Uh, if you're not signed in, you might need to be. I'm not exactly sure, but I'm just going to sign in. You're going to go up here to the products tab and then Serato DJ Pro or Lite, whichever one you're using doesn't really matter uh, because I use Serato DJ Pro. You go there. You could have just hit the download button um, and it'll take you there, but I came here. You're going to see here Serato 3.2.2 now includes support for the Alpha Theta DDJ Grav 6. I don't know how you're supposed to pronounce that so the grv6 the groove six like I, I don't know what that is um but update wise you're getting the native instruments pioneer dj controllers all the new ones that came out you're getting support for that all the new built-in sound effects which were crazy on 3.2 native apple silicone support this is something that a lot of people have been waiting for and it's absolutely fire i cannot wait to rock this on my macbook and then just native rain performer support. So if you wanted the full notes, you can just go in here, but those are the biggest updates that we're gonna be using. Hit the download button. I'm just downloading it to my desktop, but while we're here waiting for it to download, I just wanted to go over the recommended specifications because this comes up so often. Oh, is my laptop good enough to run Serato? Realistically, all it comes down to is, are you DJing at home or are you DJing for money? I will always support the fact that like, if you're going out there DJing weddings or performing like at clubs and stuff and you're getting paid for it, you should be rocking a Mac just because of how nice it runs, how smooth it runs. You're never gonna have a crash or something like that. But if you're just at home DJing, playing around, it really does not matter at all like what you use. This recommended specifications will always work. Just a i5 3000, which is pretty old, eight gigabytes of RAM, which like in this day and age is way, way old and 15 gigabytes of storage space. It's not very much. It's very minimal. Um, if you want to be rocking, like going quick, you want to be rocking stems on load. What they would say is an eighth gen i9 5000 series, which is still kind of old um, in today's age. I'm pretty sure the one I have is newer than that, uh, but 16 gig RAM, 15 gig storage, still a bit of video memory is always good. But honestly, Honestly, like any kind of laptop is going to run Serato just depends on like how much of a power user you want to be. Uh, and now it's finished downloading. So we're just going to hit this. It's going to ask you to extract it. So whatever you're using, if you're using Windows or Mac, you got to extract the file. And boom, uh, we're just going to install. Boom, so it's successful. We're just gonna close that out, close this out, close this page out. Got my desktop right here, double click that, and we are in, good to go. All right, so we are in now. I'm actually gonna be practicing very shortly, so I'm gonna give this thing a test drive and we can follow up on how good this update is. Uh, but pretty well, all you're getting on this one, like mainly is support for the brand new Alpha Theta. The Groove 6, I guess is how you're supposed to pronounce it. It's got some dedicated stems effects controls um, and some apparently new transition capabilities. So that's pretty cool. Um, and then recent updates, you just got your native Apple silicone support, which is really important. The Raven Performer support, your built-in sound effects. Let's hop in here. Yeah, once you come check out the effects, you got all of your brand new effects. This isn't brand new on this update, but they all came in on the last ones. I got a plenty of expansion packs, but everything else looks good to go. Everything else looks normal. So that is it for this video. I will see you guys on the next one. I'm going to rock this, play around with it, and then I'll make a follow-up video on how dope it is. So I will see you guys on the next video. Let's go.